Blair and today I'm going to be reviewing Magonia by Maria Davana Headley. Headley? This is a new young adult fantasy novel that I saw at my library and it looked really cool and after The Darkest Minds it seemed like a lighter fantasy that I would enjoy. And I really did. It was really good. I gave it 3 out of 5 stars. This book is about a girl named Aza and she is sick, really, really sick on Earth. Rumors about the sky being a world called Magonia. People on Earth are called the Drowners because they're drowning in oxygen because there's less oxygen in the sky. And um, she could never breathe down on Earth. And so a lot of stuff happens and it's really cool. It's fantasy. It's all about like birds and crap. And it's, it's really cool. So if you're into like some brand new fantasy, you want some new fantasy, then definitely pick this up. Now, for my review of this book, I feel like I couldn't imagine the characters as well as I could. The two like main characters, Jason and Aza, and um, I couldn't really picture them in my mind, and I feel like uh, the author could have dug deeper in explaining the characters, like what they look like, so then we could really picture them. But the concept is really neat, and I really enjoyed the new world that I got thrown into. And it's really short, so if you want a short novel, this took me a few days to read just because I wasn't con just because I wasn't constantly reading, but it was very good. Now we're gonna move on to spoilers, so if you haven't read Magonia, then you wanna leave. Spoilers. Reach out and touch. Bloom, bloom, bloom. I loved how it was birds. Like, usually I wouldn't find that very interesting, but it was so cool how, like, singing, they had powers from their singing, and it was so cool that she just turns out to be, like, the captain's daughter. It's like, what? I heart Jason. As always, I love the love so much. Having parts of the book be in Jason's perspective felt really irrelevant. Like, I wanted more of the fantasy. I wanted more of Aza. You know, Jason's part just was really boring and I didn't like it. The book, in a way, just didn't seem complete. Like, there's not really a cliffhanger, but it didn't seem like all the characters were developed very well. It seemed incomplete. Like, there could be more people, you know, things like that. We didn't really get to see her high school life. She just it, it felt very undeveloped. Okay, so I don't know how to pronounce this, but the Kanurs, is that how you say that? The birds that live inside the Magonian's chests. The bird that lived inside Azo was really cool. I liked how they all had their own Kanur, or the, the Magonian slash humans did, or whatever those were called, not the birds. I felt really bad for Milex, is that how you say that? I'm sorry, I'm butchering these names, but for the bird that lived in Aza in the beginning, I really liked him. He was cool, he was helping her out, he was slapping her, you know, telling her what she needs to do. And Forkle slapping. When, like, she said that, no, I can't because you're under, uh, Zal's magical powers, I have to go with her old bird. That seemed, like, I was like, man, Milex is your man, he's your bird, and you just, you know, throw him to the side. I know it was the right thing to do, but it just... I want to I want to see more of the Magonian world. I want to see Maganwater or Machenwater, the city, capital, whatever. I want to see more of it. I think we should have a bigger series. Is there? I hope there is. And I like Aza's name. Aza's such a bitchin' name. In a way, Aza was like Pocahontas. You know how they were like, oh, she should be with Dai. Like how Pocahontas was supposed to be with Cocoon, but she falls in love with John Smith, like how Aza falls in love with Jason the human. It's like Disney Princess Land going on. The concept is so cool, but I just feel like it could have been more developed. I could have learned more about Aza. Um, I mean, we are in her head a lot, but I feel like we could learn more. So yeah, three out of five stars. It was a good book, and if you agree with me, then please comment below. I have my Goodreads, my Twitter, my Instagram, my blog, everything in the description, so make sure to check that out. Make sure to like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you guys next time.